how crazy is this? So here's the fish market and then this is all tarpon. Yeah, watch this, watch this, watch this. Hey guys, welcome to another episode. Um, today I think I've got a really, really, really cool episode. It's going to be catching tarpon on the beach. Um, I need to hurry up. This is why I'm speaking so quickly. Um, so my rig will be a Shimano Terez with a good old trusty Stella 10K. And then I think because they've got, they've actually got very, very difficult mouths. Um, you need a very sharp hook in the first place. And then you need very, very strong leader because they've got very, very rough mouths. And when the mouths grow, um, grate against the leader, it causes the leader to snap very quickly. So that's why I'm using 150 pound shock leader. Um, but yeah, if they're there, there's guys feeding them at the, the docks. If they're there, we should get them. Um, the bait we use is a piece, some fish guts and fish gills, and then you just, you can even catch them without a sinker. Just pop it at him and one shoot it. Unfortunately, when one hits and you lose it, the whole school spooks. So you got to make sure you set that hook. It's absolutely critical that you, but it's really difficult as well because the circle, you're not supposed to strike, but you've, once he's there, you've actually got to give him a good, a good, good, ha! Otherwise, it's, the hook's going to pull. Otherwise, it's just like sitting on a piece of bone and it just comes out. But yeah, hopefully I can get you guys a fish. I'm really, really hoping so. You can see is my shock leader, 150 pound, with a, a tenno circle. Um, hopefully this does a job, I'm really hoping it does. Um, otherwise, yeah, I have no other options. I don't know how you guys tie knots, but what I find just holds very well is just a figure of eight. So you make a little cross in the line like that, go one, two, three times over your index finger, and then you just pull it back through like that. Hold. Lubricant. Pull. That's not going anywhere. Cut off the excess. And let's get down to the beach. What do you want to see? First, you have some fish cuts. Finish, man. Finish. You have to buy a fish. Where you come so late, brother? Julio, how are you doing, man? Long What's time. That, man? Long time, brother. You back, bro. you come yeah. Back. They, 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 they throw away all the bait, bro. They've thrown everything yeah, already. Yeah, but you gotta come in the morning. I don't know. You gotta buy a fish. You want to buy a fish? You buy a fish. Yeah, let's do it. Buy a fish, man. They got the, 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 they're right there. Isn't yeah, no, it's so on. It's going on man. Cut, 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 cut that like really in three pieces. I can maybe hook. Hope this one out here. Here you go, sir. Thanks, boss. Ah! Check it! Wait, yeah, I'll throw it back. Okay. Oh, you got it! Hook it, hook it, man! Oh! Grab my shoes, please. I don't think he knows he's hooked yet. He doesn't know though. Ah, uh -uh, no, he's fine. He's good. Yahoo! Wow! Big fish. <laughs> That's gonna keep him low. So it'll be done.
Are you a big fish, eh? Yeah. So guys, that's what you call bowing down to the king. Man, it's still a heartbreak, eh? My heart breaks every time I lose a fish. Yeah, man, I really wanted that fish, eh? That would have been definitely a personal best. Um, but yeah, we pick ourselves up and we try again. So you can you can see them sailing in the water there. Got it. Not exactly how I wanted to catch the fish, but at least I got a fish on film. He kind of breached himself, um, started jumping onto the rocks and that, so I kind of had to pull him off to just protect him. I don't, I don't want to hurt these fish. Um, like I said, it's completely sports fishing. I'm just here to solely have, get enjoyment out of it, um, not hurt the fish. Um, circle got him nicely on the top lip. Um, yeah, I wish I just had the circle. That circle would have done the same with the last fish. And we'd have had a much more better fight and a more prettier fish for you on camera but at the end of the day a fish is a fish i'm thankful that i got it and i can make another video for you guys um, see you next time